willing to pursue higher studies and settle down there as PR. The whole this international education era there to consider um, New Zealand Harman because you know everybody is aware of the uh, uh, the uh, the, uh, the uh, announcement that was made on the 8th of August uh, from the Immigration Minister of New Zealand. Phenomenal. I was absolutely blown away because when we got the Labour government in New Zealand here in New Zealand, uh, last year elected in New Zealand, there was talk about cutting down on immigration. There was talk about cutting down on student, uh, international student numbers and so on and so forth. So some of us in the industry as well as some of the institutions were a little apprehensive, wondering where it's going to go. But uh, amazing. I mean, the kind of policy that will come out with this brilliant. I mean, hats off to uh, whoever uh, sat down and devised this policy. I think it's a great move, uh, uh, Harman Jot. Uh, it is the right time to consider New Zealand because if you're coming to come study, the, see earlier what was happening was anybody who came and did a course in New Zealand, whether a two-year course between level four to six or a one-year course from level seven, eight, nine, ten was eligible for a one-year post-study work visa. But now they've gone so aggressive and made it so beautiful. So if you're coming for a three years bachelor's degree and study in New Zealand, you'll get a three years post-study work visa. If you're doing a level eight or a, a postgraduate diploma or a level nine master's or a level 10 PhD, also you're getting a three years post-study work visa. If you're coming for a level seven graduate diploma, which is not a degree level, but it is still a, a graduate diploma, uh, you are still getting a one year uh, post-study work visa. Uh, if you study in Auckland, if you study outside Auckland, you're getting a two years uh, post-study work visa. And if you're uh, studying in Auckland and you're a level seven graduate diploma and you need to get uh, a trade registration, the trade body registration uh, or a professional registration, you're still getting one plus one, which is a two years post-study. So I think it is phenomenal the way they, they've kind of uh, reorganized this whole thing.